Hello, and welcome to JXJ Aviation. In this video we will be looking at what happens if the landing gear cannot be retracted in flight and an in-flight turnback incident. First, let's look at a turnback incident. An Air India Express flight, a Boeing 737, takes off from Trichy and is headed to Sharjah. Just after takeoff, due to a hydraulic failure, the landing gear could not be retracted. So, the crew decides to turn back to Trichy. The aircraft had to circle over Trichy for nearly two hours before the aircraft made a normal landing at Trichy. Now let's see what happens if the landing gear does not retract after takeoff. A normal flight. During a normal flight, after the aircraft takes off, the landing gear is retracted. The landing gear retraction mechanism is provided on aircraft to reduce the drag and thus reduce the fuel consumption. Before reaching the destination, the landing gear is extended and the aircraft lands. The landing gear absorbs the weight of the aircraft during landing and is used for the movement of the aircraft on ground. Failure of the retraction system. One of the reasons for the landing gear retraction system to become inoperative is a hydraulic fault. Because of the failure of the retraction system, there is a drastic increase in the fuel consumption. The aircraft would also experience more vibrations and constant noise in the cabin. With this failure, the aircraft has to be flown below a certain speed for the entire flight. In case of a normal flight, from A to B, the total amount of fuel that is carried will not be sufficient to cater for this failure. This means that with this failure, the aircraft will run out of fuel before reaching its destination. So diverting to a different airport or turning back to the airport of origin become the available options. Why not turn back and land immediately? Almost all aircraft have a maximum weight restriction during landing, called the maximum landing weight. If an aircraft weighs less than this weight, a safe landing can be ensured. Here, a safe landing means that the landing gear can absorb the weight impact of the aircraft during landing, so it has to be ensured that the aircraft weight during landing is less than the maximum landing weight. To reduce the weight of the aircraft, the only option available is to reduce the fuel that is available on board the aircraft. Some aircraft have the option of fuel jettison, which means dumping the fuel during flight from the wing tanks to reduce the weight of the aircraft. In aircraft that do not have the fuel jettison option, the only option available is to burn the fuel. This could mean constantly flying around in circles or flying towards a different suitable airport. That's all for my video on the failure of landing gear retraction system. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please share and subscribe. And you can continue watching some of my other videos as well.